Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel and um, for those that are enthusiasts and that uh, build machines and sometimes you'll change machine. One of the questions that comes very often is can I transfer my Windows, my existing uh, Windows activation to another computer? So here's the rules and uh, the way that it works. Basically, first of all, your Windows install is for one PC only. That means if you have a PC with Windows 10 installed, activated with a product key, you are allowed to use it on only one PC. This is the rules of the Windows 10 product keys for consumers. Now, is there a way to transfer this to another PC? First of all, if you do transfer it to another PC, that means the main PC you're using it on cannot be technically used with Windows 10 anymore unless you have a new product key because you can't, like I said, use the product key in more than one PC. When you actually install Windows 10, there are several ways that this install goes through and this will decide if you can or cannot actually take a, an existing Windows and transfer it to another newer PC. If you upgraded your system for free using the free capabilities of Windows 10 upgrades, for example, the first year was free for Windows 10, if you've used that. Uh, if you actually have upgraded from Windows 7 or Windows 8.1 to Windows 10 for free, those are not transferable and you can try at Microsoft, but they will probably tell you that that's not feasible as they are not allowing people to transfer their free Windows 10 copies to a new PC. So that's that means that the PC you have with Windows 10 on it that was a free version of Windows 10 for you is the only PC it can run on and it will not activate and will not work anywhere else and Microsoft will not let you use it on another PC. If you have purchased a Windows 10 key, an authentic key, now that key is transferable as long as you keep the rule of only one PC using it. <clears throat> that means you bought a new PC, maybe you are an enthusiast and built your own desktop and you want to use it and move that Windows 10 install on that old PC to the new one, what you need to do is install Windows 10. And once you get to that activation point, you will actually use the option to call uh, Microsoft and you will explain to them that you've got an official version of Windows 10 with a product key. They, in general, are pretty relaxed on those rules. They will let you move that install onto that new PC by giving you a set of activation numbers that you'll enter in your computer. And once that is done, that PC will be the new PC running Windows 10 that is digital, digitally um, signed on that new computer. Once again, meaning that technically you should not be using the old PC anymore because the activation shouldn't be, well, actually, you're not allowed to use it on more than one PC, and you'll actually have to tell them. They are going to ask you, is it used on one computer only? And you'll have to say yes to that question because they will not allow you to run two copies. So a genuine product key is transferable to a new PC, but anything that is a free upgrade will not be transferable. It's pretty much the rule that Microsoft uses in terms of uh, transferring a Windows 10 install to a new computer. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.